Tidy there, he's very much impressed the Tony Bettenhausen team with his handling of this car. They had all sorts of problems last year on the road and street courses with Patrick Carpentier, who also struggled this weekend, incidentally, with the players' team. But Elio Castroneves, good feedback, great information for Tom Brown, the race engineer to work with, and look at the job he's doing here this afternoon. Oh, uh, no, we've got another traffic jam. What is going on here? Down at the hairpin, several cars involved. Oh, this is just getting silly, isn't it? Zanardi there involved. He's found reverse gear is trying to get round, I think. Well, no, he's stalled it now, trying to trying to get going. Oh, look at the traffic jam there. He'd yeah. actually been in the pits again. He'd stop, he's waving frantically for the guys to be pushed out again. I think Salas is uh, holding up the front of that train. I think we're going to have to have a red flag here. Well, it's just silly, yellow. They may be able to bring them through the back door into the pits if they can't get these out of the way, but uh, what a mess here. What a pity. I mean, we've seen problems at this hairpin in the past. It is an incredibly tight first gear hairpin. And if somebody uh, gets it wrong on the inside, it looks as though Hiro Matsushita might have set things off in the first place there. He's on the inside. Let's go down to the pits and hear from Paul Tracy. Tell us about your ride because you almost went over. Well, the cool car was running great. I mean, uh, we were just pacing ourselves. I got slowed down a little bit coming off the turn on the back straight. And... Uh, Christian got made a move on the outside of me. Uh, very disappointed, Paul Tracy. Then we saw that incident earlier between himself and Christian Filippoldi, which uh, flicked Paul up into the air. No harm done to him. A bit of damage to the car. Well, it's only been one of a number of incidents we've seen since then, and this one looks the most daft of all. They've all just managed to get going again. Let's see if we can see what started all this in the first place. Hiro Matsushita turned in and was hit by right Gualtas Salles. The, yeah, right across the to Gualtas Salles. I mean, Hiro is right on the outside of the racetrack there, apparently giving Salles room, and then cuts across him. Yeah, it does seem remarkable, doesn't it? I mean, you think that uh, he was so far out, I think Gualtas Salles was fully justified in going for the inside there. And just look at the chaos it causes as soon as you get a car stuck on the apex. And, of course, Gualtas stalled on the outside. There was really just no room to go through from then on in and that created the traffic jam. So, it's a yellow flag again, and we really are having a very broken, uh, broken up start to this race. We've only completed, what, 31 laps out of the 105. So we're about one third distance now, and I would expect to see Helio Castroneves coming into the pits. He's gonna have to come into the pits pretty soon now. The man is leading this race. Gilles de Ferran at the moment is second, Michael Andretti third, Dario Franchitti fourth, Brian Herter fifth, Adrian Fernandez is sixth.